What's up? What's up? What's up? This your boy Zeke Dog, and I'm back with another video. So, man, I just pulled up to How, Indiana, H O W E. We gonna go with that. And uh, I've been here before, man. I did a drop and hook here, but currently my trailer is over here at number 19, Doc 19. And it's not ready yet. He said it's going to be a couple hours. I'm like, bro. It was supposed to be ready at 3. So I'm about to call the agent and get on them. I'm going to say it nice like that. After I go drop this trailer over in the drop yard. Hey dial team, you ready to get in the trucking? Need yourself a truck? Go on, hit up Long Mail. You know who they are. Go to their website, give them a call, tell them Zeke Dog sent you. Still got a couple straps in here. Now that I think about it, I'm not gonna let them uh keep them. And I'm gonna go ahead and slide my tandems to the rear. I'm gonna be nice. Oh. Yep, yeah, always check, make sure you get your straps out. Now, if they wasn't hanging here, I could have just grabbed them. But oh no, I got them hanging. Oh man. There we go. Put that thing down here. All right. Got those locked in. Go. 
So, got the tandem slid back. Disconnect my air. Oh, electrical. Oh, man. And just sit these in here. You know what? I may go and pull these out and mess with these uh these straps. I see why people have so many of them now. You acquire them over time. Go. And now the only thing left to do is to pull the fifth wheel pin. <clears throat> there we go. Just like that. Come on. Be free and clear now. Oh, we'll ease back on over here to uh to 19. I'm letting the air down a little bit on the trailer. Now I'm gonna get over here and I'll sit tight for a couple hours. I sure was planning on being good and stopped by the end, but uh, I guess not. I'm far enough up under here to where when it's time to connect, I'll connect it. But in the meantime, I'll see about folding up some of these straps. Thank you. 
All right, it was uh two and a half hours later. They got me. They definitely got me. So uh, I hooked up. Gonna send this air to the back. While that air is transferring to the back, and uh, you know what? I like to bump up my RPMs now. That way, uh, it's more pressure being built just a little bit faster than what it normally, the rate it normally builds it. That was one of these ways. There we go. I'm gonna tip myself in the face with it. Dial team, man. Y'all know this spot, the Blue Beacon. Just got the truck washed on up. She looking a little bit better, man. I had so much dirt and grime on this girl. I got, I got to do better, man. I gotta, I gotta get her washed a little more. Just a little, just a little bit more. 
we gonna see. And it's not that I don't be wanting to get a watch, it's like I'm looking at the weather, I'm like, that's about to rain tomorrow or today. So, but still, once a week washing, man, I gotta get back to the, to doing that. That's a nice color on that piece. Yeah, so, looks pretty good. It got the tire shined all up for me. And, uh, man, of course, you gotta pay extra for the tire shine, but they, uh, they, they give me all spiffy. I still got that ugly dent on the side of the truck, man. Oh, wait. So I'm standing back from right here, I can really see it. Like, not just there, like, like above it, how it's dented in. Yeah, it's, yeah, it's bad. It's real bad. I know that's what I need a brush to put it on there. I be trying to put tire shine on mine, and man, it don't even soak in. So now I just, I'll just get them to keep putting that tire shine on there, and I don't even have to worry about it. I just pay them. I'm already paying them anyway, so maybe I'll do the tire shine in two weeks and then just do the wash every week. Same thing with the motor wash. I don't get a motor wash every time. I get a motor wash like every second or third wash. So, uh, let me show y'all, yeah, I'm gonna shine on up, man. Boy, that, what I say, you say it looking good, they looking good. I don't know if y'all can see the shine the way I can see the shine. But, uh, definitely shining, man. Oh, yeah. Tie dressing on 100. So, we're about to leave here. And it's a, uh, a TA. I don't know if y'all can see the sign right there. Yep. TA. And I'm finna pull in there and see if they can help me out with this trailer. I can't move the axles for it. It's the trailer. It ain't the Zeke dog. The, the Zeke dog know how to move it now. I've been doing this for a minute. I can slide to the left. Slide to the right. Crisscross. Crisscross. Now cha cha. Doo -doo 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 -doo. <laughs> man, who keep calling me? All these spam calls, man. They be they been non-stop. No, you know what? No, I'm finna go ahead and just block these spam numbers. Decline and then we go ahead and block them. I'm so tired of these, man. They be back to back to back. Every 10 minutes, I got another spam call. Yep. Block. Got that one blocked. And we go over here. And tap. Block. All right. So I got those spams blocked. Oh yeah, I block in a minute. Chitty chitty bang bang. All right, doll team man. I got the truck. Uh, I guess service would be the the trailer. The trailer. Uh, basically, I can slap my tandems now, man. They. It was a couple things wrong with it. It's, I say it's kind of fixed. It's fixed enough. <laughs> you yeah. know, but it's like this thing. It's almost like it's, it don't have air in here, man. But uh, I don't know what else to say on that thing. We gonna ride it. We most definitely gonna ride it, uh. Cause now I'm thinking if it ain't got air, does, does it have brakes? It do look real low on the back. I 
know what else to say. Let me uh let me pull the brakes out. Alright. I popped the brakes out. And I'm not seeing it go down or anything. And I push the brakes in. Just to see if it changes any. I don't know, I ain't no professional when it comes to it. Went to the shop with one problem, left with another one, I guess. Man, these trailers so freaking raggedy. And then look, ABS light on. And I don't know what else to say or do on that one, other than get this load here on time tomorrow. So. They roll. All right, dog, I'll tell you, man, uh, I got out a minute ago, did my pre-trip, and uh, discovered a little, a little issue. Go back in there. We don't need no no uh, placards for this load. Uh. All right, man. This truck is still looking so good. Whatever shine they put on here, it works really good that's that's one of the best shines i've had on here all right so everything looks good over here yep everything looks good over here yep now let's go to this other side Uh, everything does not look good over here. So, uh, I talked to my buddy. He was like, what you need to do is remove this line so that the air doesn't, uh, The airline doesn't break. It's not the front one, it's the it's the back one that I'm I'm worried about me not being able to uh move right. So I'm just, I'm, gonna, I'm just gonna have to get this on into a shop because I'm, I really don't want to mess anything up worse than what it is. So, yeah, let's let's not let's not mess with that. It's already jacked up. It's jacked up bad. And uh, we don't want to make it worse, but we don't want to make it worse. <laughs> Man, these tires still look good. Ooh, I, I know I keep saying that, but uh, hey, I'm around makes a big difference, or, or whatever they call it, their shine. All right, doll team. 
first stop still getting unloaded. I'm just finna peek my head in to see how how it going. All right, so we got doors over here, man. Like lots and lots of doors. All right, doll team, man. We wrapping up this last stop. It's been pretty good. Uh, besides the troubles with this trailer, man. I don't you know. At this point, I don't even know what else to say about this trailer. It, you know, I said from the beginning, man, you got some regular trailers. You know, not my cup of tea, but at the same time, I ain't paying for these trailers. But I do pay for it with my time taking it into shops so even if you got your own trailer you got to do maintenance on it 
the difference is you ain't got to pay for the maintenance other than with your time. I'm just trying to figure this thing out, man. As long as this thing keep rolling, long enough to where I can get parked tonight and, and, and get it checked out, uh, I'm going to be good. So, uh, Like I said, man, if you need a truck, you need some transportation to do some trucking, you ready to start your trucking journey, man, go on over there to Lone Mountain. Y'all see it on the shirt. Hit up Lone Mountain. You buy, a, you buy a truck, they gonna give you a free t-shirt. You ain't know that, did you? <laughs> you like Z-Dog, I can buy my own t-shirt. I'm just saying, man. Hey, Z-Dog recommended, man. Uh, tell them Z-Dog sent you, man. Hit up Long Mel. Uh, but, man, appreciate y'all checking out these videos, man. Like, share, subscribe. Turn on that notification bell. And join the dog team. So, until the next time, baby, keep it trucking.